talk about this, man. What's that? Let me see. You feel me? This is a new double. Hold on, hold on. I'm sorry. You sorry. Didn't he come out on stage? I'm sorry. Yeah, Rambo was out there. Yeah, Rambo was out there. He was doing it up. You feel me? New double XL cover. You feel me? New double XL freshman cover, 2004. Uh, yeah, man. This is a, this is who on here. You feel me? Late Banks. You feel me? Uh, big, <laughs> big X to plug, Honcho, Skiller Baby, Cash Cobain, Mexican OT, Richard Mari, you feel me? Boss Man, D Lo, Four Bats. Yeah, Scarlet. That's, that's sad. I only know one person on there. Who yeah, you know? Like, Mexican OT. I hold a lot of people that's Shout out Mexican OT. I swear to God, like, that's sad. Tell me, but one thing that's not on here right now is no West Coast artists. Not one. Yeah, I see that too. That's why I'm like, I don't know none of these people. Like, we gonna talk about how the industry and how they be discriminating against West Coast artists, specifically California artists, because that's the whole thing. Especially when we uh, there are there. no West Coast artists on this motherfucker right now. There's a stigma, and with it is crazy. And the, look at the hold on, look at the title y'all using. Not like us. What are we doing? Sick. Wow, they Sick. represent for them out of town Sick. right now. They saying the LA now. <laughs> Sick, yeah. <laughs> That's check, sick, dog. Shout out to them. Not like us. No West Coast artists. This, uh, chat, man. Chat, talk to me, chat. I want to know if y'all feel like a West Coast artist. Let me go back to my chat over here on the TV so we can all interact and talk hey, to each other. It's crazy that Blue Bucks we definitely never made talk it to nothing like that. That is crazy. Yeah. That's wild you know that these niggas never been on the Let's talk to each other, man. Double XL, freshman cover. Chat. That's fake. Let me know what's going on. Do y'all feel like this is decent? Do y'all feel like LA could have been added to this? A LA artist could have been added to this? And if it was if any LA artist, what LA artist should have been added to this? You know what I mean? Like supposed to be hella LA artists. I added mean, there's definitely something going on there as far as Los Angeles. <laughs> Can you know I tell you mean? my theory? Los Angeles just the West Coast period. Can I tell you my theory? It. And it's crazy, yeah. My theory, don't quote me on this, don't quote me on this, but my theory is they didn't want us on there because it been so many rappers that's from out of town being getting hurt out here, so they're like, fuck us. Yeah, that's my theory. Yeah, yeah. Oh, uh, yeah, y'all want to play with us and, and keep on hurting people? We ain't putting you on double XL. Yeah. Ooh, that's you a think cold. that's a real thing? That's my narrative. I don't know where everybody else. That's just me. I'll say, like, to, to kind of back that up, it's a stigma around West Coast. My fault. The stigma around West Coast artists and West Coast politics that surround the artists that make other uh, other cities afraid. Not afraid in a sense like all oh, y'all punks or nothing like that. But it's like nobody wants to deal with what comes with the West Coast artists. Nobody really wants to give that a chance or an opportunity to shine because they kind of like oh well we know that he might come with all these niggas and da, 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 da. and nine times out of ten you come blah 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 but I'll say it to you like this at the same time the young niggas who come from other southern states come with all the young niggas. It's just those young niggas can now be controlled. When you come on our side, you got to play a different game. You have to come with a little bit more respect, and it's more education on our side to how this industry and how this business is ran, and it's harder to fuck niggas over because somebody always got a big homie who was tied to this label or that label or this or that. Back in the days, they know a little bit of something. Now, think about this. Look how many hard, up-and-coming artists we got in L.A., and there's not one, to real, not a female or a nigga on here. One nigga should have been on there, and I definitely agree with the chat. It should have been 310 Baby. Yeah, yeah, 310, baby. 310 Baby definitely should have Biggest been in song. there. Got a, definitely got a platinum record. You feel me? So how you feel about it, Trevor? What you think? 18 years old. Yeah, I just Why think you they think be boy, they boy, I just think they be boycotting. I just they be boycotting the West. You feel me? They feel like niggas ain't listening to the West. They feel like the West is trash. I feel like, you know what I mean? Like, they just shunning us, pushing us to the side. I feel like that. I, and that's I why Doc do. had them all on stage. Yeah. You know what I mean? That was our double XL right there. Yeah. You've seen them all on stage. Let's get to that. <laughs> yeah. You've seen them all on stage with the greatest. So, I've, I've heard the industry niggas saying recently, I ain't going to say no names. I'll say it off camera, though. But saying recently, you know, the boy just got out of jail for the uh-uh-uh, you know what I'm saying? Off the, off the elbow for Pop Smoke. So even they looking at that like, damn, like, you know what I'm saying? They feeling disrespected about that. Well... They could be, you know what I'm saying? If it's some powers that be that's in there, they could be looking at some shit like that. But I, I uh, you know, it's, it's a bunch it's of tricky. shit that could be tied yeah. into it, though. You feel me? Like, but you, it's it's everybody's opinion in there. You know, I, I, in the double XL that's working is who who listening to what? And a lot of them niggas just don't listen to us, dog. Why you think they don't, they don't listen, listen to us? To our why? Music, but bro. why, though? Give me your reason why. Your honest reason why you think they don't listen to us, to real honestly. 
truth in the details. Why do you think they don't listen to us? What's the reason? It's Give just, us your reason. Uh, growth. I think it's growth, production. You know what I'm saying? Um, we showed all the they growth. Don't, they don't know. They don't. A lot of people. Look, they just can't. They don't know what we be talking about. They don't have a lot in common with us. And we don't be knowing half of the shit they talking about. We got to do our research and find out what they talking about. I don't to do no research about Yes, you do. It's certain lingos they say that we don't know about. Just like what... Girl, you know you fine. No. Girl, you know you fine. No, we ain't talking about the basic shit. We ain't talking about the basic shit. We talking about that hard shit. Niggas didn't even know. Okay, okay. I'm going to use this. I'm going to use this for a prime example. Oh, girl. When she be like, niggas saying good side. Ski, did nobody know what that mean? I knew what the fuck that mean because I've been in a city. Do you know what that mean when she say, niggas out oh, there hanging and she be like, ski, no. Do you know what that mean? She giving a call. For what? It don't matter. To do something, we're going to figure it out. But well, I'm going to put it like this. Basically, you're right. That's yes, a yes. Hood call? That, no, it ain't no hood call. Yeah. That's like you call a smoker nigga. It does. Oh, you see a smoker, okay, okay. he'd be like, ski, like, nigga, I'm right here. Gotcha. Hey, hey, tap gotcha. in right here. I swear to God, truth in the detail, nigga, on my mama heartbeat. Oh, that's what that mean. But all these niggas in LA talking about, if you say ski, that's some gay shit because it's a female saying it. So they feel like if a, no, that's what the niggas out there, they be like, hey, ski, that's calling the smoker to ski, whatever that shit mean. That's so, what but, it means. Yeah, but look, we. Other than that, I kind of knew what it was. Yeah, I know it. That's why I said you got it because you said it's, it's a call. It's definitely a disconnect with us on the West Coast. They don't know what we talking about. They don't can't they can't they can't relate to the gang shit we talking about. They don't know none of this shit. Like, well, they need to go question. Lingo, none of that shit. Like the shit just not changing. Like it ain't there. Like but three ten baby, you got three ten baby, O three Greedo. You know yeah. what I'm saying? You have. Motherfuckers that's out there, I would say OT Genesis, that, yeah. you know what I'm saying, that's nationwide. You do have a. Uh, Asabi, you can have, we you got hella. You feel me? That motherfuckers know. Um, Tyler, the creator, you feel me? That's just nationwide. You got a lot of motherfuckers, Q, Dot, you feel me? But it's a disconnect there. Like, we don't, niggas don't know what the fuck we talking about. You know what I mean? They don't, like, don't want to know. That's know, all that is. Y'all got the same ass know. beat. Nigga, like, what are y'all talking about, man? Get to take this shit off. Like, so I understand, like, I understand. And that's crazy. And double. we don't, we don't, like you said, we don't travel. We don't go nowhere. Nah, go somewhere. So, so we can know why this shit ain't out. You know what I mean? Yeah, real shit. Go and go see. Niggas was mad at them tacos. And that's crazy, right? You gotta that's, go somewhere to see. That's crazy, right? Because I don't know who runs a double XL page, but every time I talk to a person, I don't know who it was because I see every time they go live on their Instagram, they got this black person, this person, this person, right or wrong, right? But every time I hit that motherfucker, I got a conversation. We talking. Like, I, I'm, they follow me, I follow them. So for them to do that, that, that got me hot right there. Damn. Like, like, yeah, that got me. I can show you right now, live and direct. Texas and me and Double XL Magazine. But then you know, Payola is real too. What yeah. that mean? Niggas, um, niggas, niggas is signed. Niggas is signing. They, they labels pay for them to be in certain positions. Favor for a favor. Oh, yeah, okay, okay. Yeah, 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 politics. Yeah. And even if it, even if, even if it wasn't, you, even if it wasn't that, we still ain't getting these looks. Man, it's 2024. Every motherfucker going there ain't on there from hard work. Somebody paid to play, bro. And, and, I'm calling space. And even if we ain't still getting these looks, and it's like. Like this, like damn, like that's why I said, like you on this stage, homie. You better fucking like work your hardest, nigga. You feel me? Like you better get to where you can do what Dot did for motherfuckers. You know what I'm saying? On your level, or yeah. however it go. Like, don't disappoint, nigga. Don't get on this motherfucker and think it's all good. When you get off this mother, like, yeah, nigga, I was on stage. Think I'm good. Like, you see your boy gave grades on all the performances. Hell no, nigga. Huh? You seen the report card for the performances? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I Hilarious. seen the report card for the performances. That shit was, it was trash. trash. It was only one one thing I didn't like on that motherfucker. I, everything else, you know, I, I'll take his opinion. But this one thing I didn't like, you feel me, about so, like, nigga, fuck, what are you talking about right now? Like, it's dark as fuck. You know what I'm saying? Like, right. My <laughs> brother barely can see. You know what I mean? Like, yeah, nigga know. barely know what's He barely fuck. can see. Yeah. Like, that's like, why I can't if, if, if you pay attention, when they brought him out, and this is my brother, I love him. You see Kendrick Harry up, went right there. And he had his hand on Kendrick the whole time like this. Right. Like, don't get that soul like that. Nigga's a legend and a fucking goat out here, nigga. For real, nah, for you, real. You, yeah, you can't. You for can't. real, don't ever play with his name like that. Because niggas get hurt playing with soul name. 
Oh, one thing that was stupid funny, nigga, that was out here, nigga, was this shit right here. Now, this Bunch shit right this. here. Oh, yeah, I didn't know who that young lady was, but I, I didn't know who she was, but I knew she had to be somebody hey, she like this. Away, hey, I had to call you. Like, what the fuck going on? Away. She looks comfortable. I'm being bumped in with the members. Hey, Bobby Blood. You got to say what's bracket. That was hilarious. She's like, okay. <laughs> she didn't say it, though. She just looking at that nigga like, okay. I know, I know, not, to, I know not to say that. Right. Oh, I know not to say nigga, that. Now, that was fucking hilarious, homie. Yeah, that I had was, to do my research on her. I didn't know that who that was. That was fucking hilarious, my bad, you homie. Me. No, no, you go. That was hilarious, bro. But yeah, man, you feel me? On the Fulio shit, man. I don't see a lot of motherfuckers uh, touching on that shit right now. 